Perfect. Once the card's been signed, we'll recap. Okay. That's the pen. Why? Oh, I... yeah. <laughs> it's the joke. If I go through... <laughs> Just explaining to everybody else. Would you hold out your hand just flat like I that? I certainly will. I'll place the cards here. Place your other hand on top, sure. trapping the cards in between. I will. Bet. Fully and effectively, and I'll remove one card. Okay. If I removed your card, would that be impressive? That would be very impressive. No, it wouldn't. I got a joker. It's okay. okay. It's okay. okay. How about this? I can do better than that. Okay. If I could reach in between your hands and straighten one card up, uh -huh. so it's the opposite direction, and it was your card, the seven of diamonds, would that be? That'd be pretty good. Okay, I can do better. How about this? Would I fool you if I were to put those cards back in new deck order and put the one card reversed? Yeah, that'd be pretty good. Okay, I'm not going to say you're going to fool me. I won't say that yet. Good, good, okay. good. How about, how about if I took the cards and put them in new deck order, reversed the one card, put them in the cardboard box, put the paper seal and wrapped them up in the plastic? Oh, that would be a fine trick. I just did it. Take a look. It's a brand new deck of cards. Because you're the closest, I want you to see. Is there a cutter slit in the top of the box? There is not. Cutter slit in the bottom of the box? No. no not that I can see. How about the side? Not that I can see. The other side? Not that I can see. Top or back? Nope. It's a brand new deck of cards. I believe so. I'm going to pop this open. Inside, there is a paper seal. It says United States Playing Card Company. Not Canadian. Deja vu. <laughs> Deja vu. <laughs> Deja vu. Sometimes it takes four. Look, I'm going to pop open the paper seal. Inside, a brand new deck of cards, never touched by human hands. Okay, yeah, that's perfect. I remember You've it from last card. time. Yeah, yeah. I want to point something out. If you look at the deck, there isn't a premium card on the end. Do you know why? Why is that? They're in my pocket, remember? Mm-hmm. Get them out. There's a lot of them. There's the jokers and the premium card. Mm -hmm. All of them are in here. That means that this should be a new deck order deck. Take a look and see if they run ace through king. Oh, maybe you could turn this way so the I camera mean, yeah, can see. Yeah, that, that, Someone who was a professional in the show business would have done that automatically. <laughs> now, when you get to the diamonds, do you notice one card is I reversed? Do. Between the eight and the six of diamonds. Would be where the seven exactly should be. Exactly where my selected card should be. And would you like me to remove it to make it easier for you? Uh, I'll actually, just kind of pull it like that okay, lightly sure. and turn it around like that so you can see. It really does. Okay, so I know you're not going to tell us how you did it, but that was unique. Does it's anyone a trick. else do that? It's my job. But then, does anyone else? <laughs> <laughs> Hello, you can't share. But does anyone else do that particular technique? No, there know? was uh, not not the similar technique. The same effect was a gentleman by the name of George Schindler many years ago. Now the dean of American magicians. He inspired me, but I came up with a completely different method. And that will be uh, the key, I guess, this evening to fool those guys. If it's sure. a new method and they haven't seen it before and they can't put their finger on it, we'll get away with it. And by, by we, I mean you, of course. Although I'd like some of the reflected glory. Um, <laughs> That's awesome. I'll share. And is that one of the most technically difficult ones in your in your routine to do? It is, in fact, not the most technically difficult, uh, but it's probably the most fun to present because most of it takes place in the spectator's hands, and yeah. I think magic that takes place in somebody else's hands is so much more powerful That's than magic what, that takes place in our own. That's what I tell my wife all the time. That's right. <laughs> I'm learning some tricks at home. That's all it is. I think we have given you enough time. Uh, uh, yeah, this is a really, really tough call for us. I think anybody has to know that at some point you had to do a deck switch. Unfortunately, there was uh, a moment when uh, we both saw it, when you were pulling the pen out. Yes. And we had all these discussions and meetings about this, which we've talked for hours with the producers about what would constitute fooling us.